Like, what are we doing right now? What's up, P-Nation? It is our first time in La Jolla, California. We are just arriving, and what are you expecting from this place? What have you heard? What is La Jolla in your head? All I know is that it's supposed to be beautiful. I've heard by accident, I think from you, that there's a cave, and my dad was like, oh, if you're gonna go near San Diego, you need to go to La Jolla. And that's literally <laughs> it. That's all I know, that it, it's supposed to be beautiful. It's supposed to be really beautiful. There's supposed to be lots of natural beauty, mm -hmm. caves, cliffs, yeah. apparently mm -hmm. seals, <gasps> which is the first thing on our list. We're here super early, so hopefully we can see some seals. We haven't seen seals since we were in Antarctica, so I'm super excited. Let's go! What? Look at how little they are. What? Oh my gosh, they're just sitting right there? <laughs> I was like, what? They look, honestly just look like rocks. Let's go check it out. so random. I love this. I love seals so much. We bought a stuffed animal seal pup in Antarctica, so it's like this arctic seal. We take it everywhere as like our pet. Look, they're coming out of the water! Honey! <laughs> they are so cute! So this is our first stop. It's actually called Children's Pool. They built this like barrier so that the kids could swim on the beach because there's like no room to swim on the beach because it's just cliffs. And then the kids left and the seals came and now it's basically their beach. If I was a seal, I would live here. One. These cliffs are beautiful. This town is beautiful. The water is beautiful. Like, just look how clear the water is. You don't get this kind of clarity on the East Coast. Like, I'll say it. West Coast water is beautiful. I just can't believe they live right here. Like, why here? Like, we don't know? I guess it's a natural harbor. I don't know, or not natural. It's an artificial harbor that's protected. I wonder what kind of seals they are. Keep moving. Look at them. like what are they oh, galumphing so when they move on the beach and they do that like worm type thing it's called galumphing and it's just like the worst word and they're so chunky but they're so cute at the same time I just love them so much and it's crazy people are scuba diving out there this whole underwater part is a marine sanctuary so you can scuba dive you can snorkel but obviously snorkeling is uh, a little choppy for that and you're already gonna wear a wetsuit if you scuba so you might as well go down in the water What's even crazier is that they're swimming with these seals, like all at the same time. Oh. We need to scuba out there. I want to scuba dive with seals. That's on my new bucket list. We're gonna be scuba diving with seals one day. That would be a dream come true. We found more. I wonder if we can find sea lions, if they're seals. Just look how clear this water is. Like honestly, just wanna swim in it. I wish it wasn't cold. If that was La Jolla, that would be enough. That would be enough for me. That was so much fun. The Galam thing. And this guy's an artist behind us. I think that's why Leah's dad wanted us to come here because people are artists here. We've seen like so many people selling trinkets and paintings and he's literally painting behind us. Like, there's an artist community on the cliffs, by the beach, with seals. 
Yeah. What more could you ask I for? I want to live here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> something he has planned. I think he had to make a reservation for an event and I'm pretty sure it deals with a cave. So let's go. I think we're coming to seal lions. They look a lot bigger. Oh, and I think they're shedding. Beautiful. Beautiful brown. Are they different? California. they are are just like dogs of the sea and I'm serious about like the whole reincarnation thing like I want to come back as a seal I just want to lay in the sun they have the life you guys this place is truly incredible just like all these artists living together with scuba divers and seals mm -hmm. And sea lions. painters and people selling trinkets and there aren't that many tourists and I just I didn't know I didn't know you could like Me walk either. in caves or like I, I don't know okay so I'm like seeing the cave behind us and if this is what we're doing I am too excited so when I asked my parents like what we should do in La Jolla my mom gave me a list of one thing she said you have to go to the cave store and I was like what is the cave store and she was like there's a secret entrance but it just looks like an unassuming building. And that is definitely what we're about to go into. We're here. Okay, you guys. We're going down there. Um, you would book it at blessedstore.com, but we're sold out of the 26th of January, next Tuesday. Oh. <gasps> what is this? Thank you. Oh. What is this? Okay, um, on, uh, on a scale of one to 10, I'm 10 surprised. I had no idea that this is what we would be doing. We're in a cave. We're walking down a flight of, as she said, six stories worth of steps. Um, we went into a store and through a secret door, and now we are heading down to I don't know what, and I am, my mind is being blown right now that Zach was able to, one, keep this secret from me, and just that, how cool this is. Like, what are we doing? It's crazy. This is crazy. Zach, you're gonna have to duck. <laughs> okay, so we're switching over to the tiny camera because it does really well in the dark. And oh my, just look. I don't know if you'll be able to perceive how steep these stairs are, but if you look that way up the stairs, it is very steep. <laughs> okay. Yeah, not for tall people, but that's all good. So the story is that an artist came to La Jolla and he wanted to attract people to a store. And so he was looking for something that was very rare, not found anywhere else. So he said, what if I have a tunnel that goes to a cave attached to my store? People will come through here to go into the cave and see my art. And this is what the result was. I actually don't have words because this is just too cool. How does one store own this? Can I like yell in here? I feel yeah. like it's gonna like fall in. Oh my gosh. thing about this is that they're only letting one group of people come down here at a time so we are the only people in this cave for 30 minutes we have 30 whole minutes just to spend in here by ourselves so she was like you can take off your masks as long as you when you come back up to the store you put them back on this is just so cool and what was this free this is not free but there's a and it's free how much was it Ten dollars a person. Ten dollars a person. Steal of a deal. Like, great price. This is worth ten dollars to do this. Oh. And the waves are crashing, and it's like really cold down here. I'm glad I have a sweater on. This is just too cool. Like, those stairs were just too cool. How did they carve those out? 
That's too much. How'd they build those stairs? I don't know how they how this exists. It's so cool that like one store, and it's just like a trinket store. Like it's not like a restaurant or anything. It's literally just like a random store on the cliff. Very unassuming. Like you wouldn't know what you were looking at from the outside. I would have passed right by it. Thank you, Zach's mom, for telling us about this place because this is just this is just an awesome experience. And I think it's also really cool because I had no idea what we were doing. <laughs> like, what a surprise. Alright, our 30 minutes is up. We have to head back upstairs now. Hopefully Zach doesn't hit his head on the way up. The lady was like, you have to be careful, especially if you're tall, because you will hit your head. So Zach, be careful. We don't need a concussion on this trip. So we're heading back up right now. <gasps> that was so tiring. Those stairs are no joke. And they're like, I don't know. It was really hard. <laughs> Whew, today was amazing. The cave store was amazing. Seeing all the seals was amazing. Like I couldn't have asked for a better day. La Jolla is my new favorite place to be. It's my new favorite city, town, seascape, cliffside, beautiful wonder of a place. I love it so much. I think it's my new favorite place in California. Like, it was incredible. I don't even know. You if, guys have to come here. If you love sea life, if you love animals, just if you in love general. Artists. If you love matter. beautiful scenery. Everything. If you love caves. We were in a cave today. It's just the best. Thanks for watching.